Okay, today's video is about using geolocation within Cordova. Now, the basic code itself, this is the same as code that you would put on any web page. You check for navigator.geolocation. If the browser supports that, you can set up your options and call either watch position or get current position. So we do have the navigator geolocation dot watch position. That's going to have the same callbacks. And then if you ever want to get rid of that, you need to have it in a variable. So let's say uh, GW. And then we would say navigator dot geolocation dot clear watch. And then you pass in the thing that you want to forget about. So this is the alternate version for constantly checking. And if you only want to get the position one time, then we do what we have here, the get current position. Okay, so that's the exact same as what you would do in the browser. The difference with doing geolocation inside of a Cordova application is with this, we do have to add the plugin. So you would run the command for, uh, here if I go down to the terminal, it would be Cordova plugin add and then the name of it, Cordova plugin geolocation. So that's all you have to add. Now, when you do that command, you will get this entry in your config.xml file. So it does add the plugin with the version number. This is the name of it. And you'd think that that would be all that you have to do, but there is one other thing if you're going to be doing your app for iOS. In the case where you're doing it for iOS, we also have to add in these extra permissions here, the edit config. We have to edit the info plist file to say that the NS location when in use usage description, we've got to add that property. Now you can do it from the command line, but it's just much easier to paste this in here and edit the XML. This is the reason that you have to provide to justify the reason for asking for the person's location. So the person will see this message when your app is being approved by Apple, they will look at this message to see whether or not it's a valid excuse to get the person's location. All right, so plug in, add with the terminal, and then add this string. What I will do is I will add both this command and this string into the description of the video down below. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments down below. And as always, Thanks for watching.